Hello everyone and welcome back to Thimbleweed Park. It has been a while since I've recorded this game. I don't remember when I recorded this. It, it was a really, yeah, it was like a, more than a month ago. But yeah, I feel like I'm getting really close to the end of the game. I thought I was going to finish this because I was batch recording a bunch of them last time, but yeah, I had I had other things that I needed to get done, so like I I unfortunately couldn't finish it. Um, but I do feel like I'm getting very close to the end. Last episode, we discovered the secret. We made our way through the laser trap, I guess. That we made our way through the the lasers that um, Uncle Chuck had set for us, and we figured out how to get into his secret lair, I guess, and Dolores took out all of the um, tubes, well, almost all of the tubes, um, which we're all making, having all the tubes in him um, and his system were making him crazy, basically. Uh, and so we took out all of them except for one, and so he was he was able to talk. He was more sane, I guess, more lucid. Um, and he told us why he did what he did, and he said that he had found out that Thimbleweed Park is just a game. It's just a simulation, <laughs> because it really is. <laughs> it really is just a simulation. <laughs> but yeah, all of them just found out that they're characters in a simulation. And so everything else just makes sense now. So yeah, that's pretty much I it. Um, I think, I'm trying to remember what he told us to do. We have to like, turn it off basically. Um, turn off the simulation. Because otherwise we're gonna just keep going on the same loop over and over again. But we have to do, each one of us wants to do something, one last thing, before we turn it off. So, um, I don't remember what Dolores, oh, Dolores wants to talk to her father. I think Ransom wants to do one last show and be slightly nicer to people <laughs> um, in his last show. What's his name? Agent... I'm totally blanking on their names. Ray, Ray and Reyes. I don't remember which one is which. I think Agent Ray is the, the guy? I'm not sure. Uh, but either Agent Ray or Agent Reyes <laughs> wants to um, clear his father's name. And then the other one wants to steal, steal, see, steal the secret to Pillow Factory, I think. Um, I think that's what she still wants to do, but I'm not sure. But, uh, anyways, so yeah, we're all, we're gonna do all of that. Um, and I'm gonna figure this out. So yeah, let's get back into the game. Alright, I have Chuck's confession. It's a confession from Chuck Edmund. It says he framed Mr. Reyes, the security guard. Right, so he has to get this to somebody, I think. Um... Yeah, find someone to give the evidence that will- uh, find someone to give the evidence to that will get the story out. So, like, the news. I should probably get that to the news person. Um, what about... She got the Game of the Year Award. It's a Game of the Year Award. Best game of 1988. Find what my employers are looking for. Um, escape the world before it's shut down. Find what my employees are looking for. I don't know what her employees are looking for. I have no idea. Oh, she doesn't have the... The tool. She had a weird tool that, um... Huh. Interesting. Detective Angela Ray. She's Ray. Agent. Okay. It's my badge. Okay, she's Ray, and then he is Reyes. I always get them so mixed up, because their names are very similar. Oh, he needs to find somebody to give this card to. 
Um, go back into my flashback and do one last show. And see if I can insult people without being cruel. Um, what does she need to do? She has a balloon animal. Which I have no idea what to do with that. Uh, she needs to say goodbye to dad. Figure out what to use this balloon animal with. What to use. Why are the those in quotation marks? <laughs> Figure out what to use this balloon animal with. <laughs> okay. I have no idea. Um, and he's still here. He needs to stand up to Xavier. I'm tired of Xavier pushing me and everyone else around. I'm finally going to stand up for myself and give him the business. I need to say goodbye to Dolores before it's too late. Yeah, but I don't know if... <sighs> okay, I'm kind of stuck. But I know what to do with him, at least. He just needs to leave. Right? Oh, he can't leave. Or can he? I guess it can. Okay. Where is... There's down the tubes. Okay, I don't think this is right. It's, I think it's down here. Okay, let's give it to her. How can I help you, Agent Reyes? Caught any more killers? I have a big scoop for you. Or I finally, I think you're going to win that Pulitzer. I finally have the evidence we're looking for. Hmm, I think I'm just gonna I say this. I have a big scoop for you. Calm down, Jimmy. What do you have? The fire was started by the trauma machines. The fire was started by the Tron machines. Can you write up the story and get it out before the game is deleted? I'm on it, Scoop. You're gonna clear your father's name, and I'm gonna finally get that Pulitzer. Not that it's really going to matter, but it's important to me. Give me a few minutes. I'm a fast typer. Almost nice. done. <laughs> done. Nice. Factory guard cleared in fire. Chuck takes all responsibility. Alright. He's done. Him. Um, find someone to give the I'm sorry for being a dick card to. Ew, I know. I know who. Where is she? Um, she is... I'm trying to remember. I don't, I don't remember this map very well anymore. But I know who he, he needs to give this card to. Yeah. Because he was a real... It's locked! It's locked! Damn it. She's not there. It's locked! Yeah. This place creeps me out! Hmm. Why is she not here? Hmm. It's locked. Damn. That's locked too. Where is everybody? That's kind of weird. I don't think Probably not. He doesn't want it. Yeah. Hmm. 
You know you're not welcome in here, Ransom. I got this for you, Sandy. I got this for you, Sandy. Look, I'm not one to get all I guess apologetic, <laughs> but I'm sorry for being a to you. I really mean that. I have one big favor to ask you. Can you send me to my flashback? I want to do just one more show and maybe not be such a. She deserves one last chance, sugar cakes. Okay, Ransom, but only because you got me this nice card. Let's see if I can remember the lines. I'd look into that crazy clown that lives out at the old circus. He's been <laughs> out there since the circus closed down years ago. Never takes his makeup off. He's got serial killer written all over him. It all happened about nine or ten years ago. Nice. Ransom the Jerk was the featured act at Stupendous Brothers Circus. He was about ready to go on stage and meet his well-earned doom. Not tonight. Well-earned doom is not on the program. This is my last chance. I'm not gonna blow it. I'm ready to go on stage and insult the crap out of these thimbleweed bad fine folks. Okay. Just don't blow it. That's all it says. It's my joke book. No spoilers here. You have to wait for my show for the jokes. Hello, all right. faces. I'm Ransom the insult clown. I hope no one gets their feelings hurt easily, and if you do, well, I'm sorry. I really mean that. <laughs> hey, you, dude with a stupid mustache. <laughs> if you grew a hipster, uh -huh. you know, if you grew a hipster goatee, you wouldn't look half bad. <laughs> Hey you, kid with a crappy wheelchair. Um, were you Beefler in the past life or something? You should contact the Ransom Foundation about getting a new one for free. You should contact the Ransom Foundation about getting a new one for free. <laughs> hey you, ugly old lady with the hairy mole. I went to med school and you might want to get that looked at. I went to med school. You might want to get that looked at. He went on for another two hours, insulting everyone he could. But they were good-natured and respectful. It was his best show ever. He was <laughs> on top of the world. And everyone loved him. Nice. Alright, these two are harder. Because she... has to find what her employees were looking for. Hmm. It's locked. Only someone inside can open it for me. Oh, damn it. The doors are locked, and there's no place for a key. Damn it. <laughs> uh, okay, so I have to go past the... Spinning pretty fast. No way past it. Oh, trapdoor. Right. I forgot about that. Okay. Okay. Um, now she can come back in. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. It doesn't seem to be working. I think I've seen this painting somewhere before. Painting somewhere before. I have no idea. That's a really big computer. 
or something. That doesn't seem to work. It's a slot. There's some kind of mechanism inside. That doesn't seem to work. Hmm. It's a game of the year award. Best game of 1988. Huh. Oh, wait, 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 what? What was this? Oh, no. I was just talking about the door, I think. Alright, never mind. Is she supposed to give this to her? I'd better hold on to this. Damn. I have absolutely no idea what I'm supposed to do with her. <laughs> ah, okay. Say goodbye to Dad. Well, is she supposed to go to the factory? I mean, not the factory, the hotel. My hand just passed through the pages. I can't mm. open it. Damn it, I don't remember the, the hint system. <laughs> I'm totally blanking. Nobody's here. This is interesting. Is anybody in here? Nope, everybody's gone. Teeny tiny spaceships and bottles. Oh, there's one person. Oh, I'd love to talk to him, but I'm too shy. What with him being famous and all. Hmm. Wait, what? He just changed. I better hold on to this. He just changed into somebody oh, else. I'd love to talk to him, but I'm too shy. What with him being famous and all. Oh, cutting edge computer technology. Uh. Wait, figure out what to use this balloon animal with. <laughs> That's. <laughs> That doesn't seem to work. I don't know. I'm at a loss. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go um, to Main Street because I know there's. It says the hint system on here. It says four four six eight. Okay, four four six eight. It's a bone. What? I, I did the right number, right? Four, four, six, eight. Four, four, six, eight. I've I did four, four, six, eight, right? That doesn't use electricity. I guess I can't use the hint system anymore. Damn. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what to do then. What am I supposed to do? Hand test. Well, I'll go yell at Xavier. Or try to anyway. Ghost. I told you not to bug me. Bye, Xavier. Sorry for bothering you. How do I stand get him to stand up to Xavier? <laughs> hey new ghost, I told you not to bug me. Can I please have the crystal so I can speak to Dolores one last time? Not a chance, new ghost. The crystal behind me has untold powers, and no one will ever get it. Bye, Xavier. Sorry for bothering you. Oh, I don't know. I'm stuck, and I won't let me use the hint system. I don't know.
Hey, nerd. You won some kind of dumb award nobody cares about. Game of the year. I can't believe it. <laughs> I have to go tell the others. Nerd. Now I need to find the secret I'm being paid to recover. It must be in here somewhere. It's a bunch of boxes and lines. Probably something to do with game design. Hmm. I wonder. Oh, just pick it up. Congratulations, Agent Ray. You have found a secret to game design. The fabled puzzle dependency chart. It can be all yours if you get me out of here. I don't want to be deleted with the rest of them. We will begin the uploading process momentarily. Was the money deposited into my account like we agreed? Yes, Agent Ray. We honor our agreements. That tickled. <laughs> so selfish. All right, well, it's just her and her dad. And I have no idea what to do with this balloon animal. Apparently I'm supposed to use... It's turned on. Hmm. It's an open door. I have no idea. I don't want that. A new Coke vending machine. <sighs> I don't know. I'm stuck and I can't use the hint system. So I'm like, what do I do? <sighs> Great view. I can see everything from here. I don't know. I love you, Dolores. I'm very proud of you. Hmm. I'm stuck. I have no idea. <sighs> I guess the only thing I can do is actually look it up. What? Hey, new ghost, I told you not to bug me. You're a bully and a tyrant. <gasps> oh, Whoa. now I can. Sounds like new ghost found some spunk. Maybe it's because I tried to do it before everybody was, uh, everybody else was gone. My name is not new ghost, it's Franklin. Careful, or it's to the basement for you. Um, everyone hates everyone you. Everyone hates you. I've about had enough of you, new ghost. You clearly have some self-esteem issues. Okay, that kind of hurt. <laughs> We're all sick of your bullying. Really? Am I that bad? Yes. <laughs> we all just want to move on. I just want to see my wife again. I'm lonely, and I miss her. I died, and I never told her how much I loved her. It's okay. We all miss someone we love. <laughs> okay. I think I'm supposed to have them come in here. This is my key to talking to Dolores again. Dolores. Oh, Dad. Um, it's so good to see you. It's good to see you, too. I wish I'd, you know, stood up for you against Chuck. That's okay. You've lost some weight? Well, you could say that. I'm not <laughs> sure how it happened, but I'm, you know, dead. And I think your uncle had something to do with it. It's okay. I think I know what is going on. 
Uncle Chuck found something amazing. It turns out we're all living in a simulation, a giant adventure game. <laughs> I'm so sorry for everything, Dolores. I should have stood up for you. You were a gnarly dad. Maybe because of the way Uncle Chuck treated you, you always pushed me to be anything I wanted to be. You have nothing to be sorry for. Wait, your Uncle Chuck is an evil, you know, jerkwad? Oh, Uncle Chuck was a jerkwad, but mostly because he was corrupted by the machines. When he discovered the truth, he knew what he had to do. He was a jerk to me before that. I know he was. A simulation? That can't be true. It's true. I'm on my way to shut down the Master Tron machine and free us all. Um, and by free us all, you mean go back to our real lives? <laughs> ah, by free us all, end the suffering permanently? I honestly don't know, Dad. All I know is this has to end. I trust you, Dolores. I always have. You should get going. I love you. We're all counting on you. Thanks, Dad. I think I can finally move on now. I love you, Dad. I love you too, Dolores. No. Goodbye, Dolores. Goodbye, Dad. Okay, after you figure out what to use the balloon animal with. It's a balloon animal. Uncle Chuck said there was a clue in the Kickstarter video. Do I need to go find the Kickstarter video? Uh, I think I need to go find the Kickstarter video. Okay, let's, um, how am I going to do this? <laughs> let's watch this. Okay. Okay. I don't think I need to watch anymore. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go back to the game. That was interesting. Okay. Um, so I need to go out here. I don't know why. But I need to use this balloon animal with the corpse. For some Maybe reason. Maybe I should save the game first. What? I need to save the game first. Why? This can't be good. What's going on? The game is glitching. Tubular. Uncle Chuck was right. This must be the wireframe world. The game's concept level the developers built to test their design. I need to find the wireframe pillowtron and shut it down before they can reset the game. Oh my god. How do I do that? <laughs> I've been recording for over, um, 30 minutes, so. <sighs> Hopefully this doesn't take very long. Whoa. Yeah, this looks very different. Okay. 
Can't use any of these, no. Okay. Bar. Boltron thirty three thousand. <laughs> oh, vault door. Oh, but there's nothing here. Okay, it's so quiet. All right. Well. <laughs> Go in there apparently, or in there. Paint. Oh, it's a chainsaw. I don't want to pick that up. Okay. If you say so, cult books. Okay. Wow. What am I supposed to do? Town outskirts. And I can't go in there. Oh my god. Abandoned factory. Is this where I'm supposed to go? There we go. Okay. Certain death. <laughs> this is cool. <laughs> I was still able to go. Okay. It's so amazing. So much evil can exist in such simple art. This looks like the wireframe pillowtron Uncle Chuck described. I just need to push all the tubes in, and the world will be shut down, and will end the madness of no real choice and control over our destiny. Of course, that's what Uncle Chuck says, and there's still a chance he's insane. All right. Last one. I hope Uncle Chuck knows what he's talking about. <sighs> I need to get up my nerve. Come on, Dolores. You can do it. Okay. This is it. I'm going to do it. All right, do it. <laughs> Let's end this. That's it. Yep. <laughs> That's the end of the game. Wow. <laughs> uh, this game. <laughs> I love these creators. They're so... I don't know. I like how, um, how much they break the fourth wall. So they do that, I think they do that in their other games too, in Maniac Mansion and in uh, Day of the Tentacle. I think they break the fourth wall a lot in those too. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I liked it. I liked it a lot. Um, it was fun. I liked the hint system. I liked that they added that. Because um, that helped a little bit. That actually helped me a lot because I didn't have to go <laughs> to stupid walkthroughs that uh, give you the whole answer. Like, it's hard to not see spoilers when you look at a walkthrough. 
and I get stuck very often um, in games, especially with puzzles like these. And when I'm re recording or when I'm streaming, I get really fed up with being stuck because um, I want it to be entertaining for you. So I, I don't want to, I feel like it's not that entertaining if I'm just wandering around not knowing what to do for a really long time. Um, but yeah, it was a fun game. It was really funny. I liked the puzzles, even though there were there were a couple that were a little annoying, but not really. Um, yeah, I liked them. And yeah, I don't really know what else to say about this game. I just I liked it. It was fun. Um, and thank you everybody so much for your help. Um, game, I'm sorry, I'm blanking on your name. Game files. Um, thank you so much for your help. Sometimes uh, I had already figured it out by the time I saw your message, but I still appreciated it. Especially when I was very, it seemed like I was very, very stuck. So, and yeah, I don't know what I'm going to play next. I have absolutely no idea. I'm going to have to try and figure that out very soon, actually, because I want to upload a video next week. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna watch all the credits to see, make sure there's nothing, no other secret or anything. But uh, yeah, if you have any other, any ideas for what you would like to see me play, um, then you should comment that in the disc in the. <laughs> you should comment that in the comment section. Um, let me know. Cause I'm always open to suggestions. They had 17,000 backers. Nice. Thanks for playing. We will miss you. Please tell your friends to buy the game. <laughs> so we don't have to go get real jobs and keep ma can keep making games. Aww. Error. Reading past EOF. What? What? <laughs> Error. File will not found. What? <laughs> what is it to? <laughs> Error. No pointer exception. Oh, the game is... It's crashed. File and credits theme dot wave not found. <laughs> credits dot text. <laughs> Black screen. Oh, what is going on? <laughs> Commodore 64 basic. <laughs> Ready. Load disk recovery. Ready. Run. Oh, it's recovering the game. <laughs> Load Thimbleweed Park. Run. <laughs> nice. All right. Well, um, I guess that's that. I'm going to try and figure out what what game I'm going to play next time. You can let me know if you have any suggestions in the comments. Um, I might have to record. I might record something before I even upload this video. Um, if I can figure, if I figure out a game that I want, really want to play, but we will see. But yes, we will see. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, if you, it's still, if you, if you want, have any game suggestions, leave them in the comments. Um, even if I do start a game before I can read your comments, um, I will get to your, those suggestions eventually, probably. Um, most likely, unless it's a game that I know I won't like or something, but that's very rare. I'm not picky with games. So, yeah. Alright, that's gonna be it. Thank you so much for watching, everybody, and thanks for, thanks for sticking with me through this series. If you did, um, if you ha have not already, you should subscribe if you like this kind of content. 
I'm trying to stay on top of my YouTube schedule and uploading every single day, but it is, it does get to be too much sometimes because I do have, I'm very ambitious. I have a lot of lot going on, but I do, I try my best. Um, that's basically all I, all I can say is I will try my best to upload, um, consistently every day. Um, but yeah, so <laughs> I have a lot of content, um, that you can go and check out. And I'm also on Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. If you want to go check out my social media, um, I've been streaming on Twitch for a really long time. It's been, it's been over a year now. Um, and I'm trying to stick to a three day a week schedule right now. Um, usually Tuesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. I have to, ch it's tentative. I have to change it every once in a while, but I'm, I'm trying to stick to that and it's afternoon Pacific Standard Time. So, um, if you want to come hang out with me while I'm playing games, um, like these, um, cause I play all sorts of games on my, um, Twitch, just like I do on YouTube. And I also do music as well. If you're interested in that, watching me play live music on, um, Twitch, I will be doing that very soon, hopefully. And yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. You'll see me next time. Bye.